Oh my gosh, this is the best part of the fish, the cheeks. Oh, yummy. I'm going to show you how to cook this very good tasting fish. This is your uncle burpee yoga. Yeah, this fish is delicious. Ho, ho, maya. Fitness, foodies, and the fabulous absurd. From burpees to camu, you're never going to know what you're going to get from your unk. Burpee yoga uncle. Before we get started, please hit that like and subscribe button and share this video. Mahalo. All right, I just got this fish. It cost about, I think, eight dollars. Um, the reason why I want to make it because I just went to a restaurant and they were charging like fifteen dollars. Sometimes as high as thirty dollars for this fish. And so, uh, you know, it's really not that hard to make it. Uh, in the restaurant, they actually do it two different ways. Uh, they fry it, also they steam it. Uh, I'm gonna steam it because it actually tastes better. The meat on this fish is really succulent. Uh, I like the, the tenderness of it. There's not much bones in there except for the fins, but that's actually the best part. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and actually clean it. And uh, to be honest, uh, where I'm at, uh, if I wanted to wait at that supermarket, they would actually clean it for me. Uh, but in this fish, Unlike other fishes, uh, it, does, it does have scales and uh, you do have to clean it, but the scales are not big and they don't fly everywhere, so it's not that hard to clean. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, take out the guts inside. Um, that's one thing that uh, when you steam a fish, it's very important. You want to take out the gills and the inside because if you steam it without it, without taking out all the inside stuff, uh, it, it tastes kind of bitter and it tastes kind of gross. Um, I guess in certain countries they, they don't clean it, they actually just fry the whole darn thing. So you know when you fry stuff it, it just tastes good um, no matter what you do to it. I mean I've been to uh, Asia and Shanghai and you go to the out outdoor uh, uh, markets, they literally have fried centipedes and fried, I don't know what they are but I didn't eat any of it. So yeah fried food is like uh, almost anything tastes good fried. So here I am taking out the guts and uh, if you like fishing or crabbing that that stuff right there that's gold you put that into a um, into one of those uh, crab uh, baskets to catch them with those inside oh my god the crab just comes right away and so here I am taking out the gills and everything and after I'm done with it uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and, and wash it and again this fish is about I would say a pound and a quarter uh, the one I ate for about fifteen dollars or so. It's, it's even smaller than this, but but and then uh, it's uh, it tastes good, but it's just it's, it's really not that hard to cook fish. Uh, my 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 parents uh, taught me how to do it when I was a really young age, uh, especially the live ones. It doesn't make sense to uh, fry them, especially if they're live. Uh, this one, unfortunately, is not live. It's hard. You see all that dirt there? That's why you have to clean the inside. That's actually coming from the fish inside because this is a ground bottom feeding fish. It stays in the sand. If you don't clean it and you, and you fry it, you're going to be eating all that junk. So, yeah, you see that? Yuck. Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, now I'm going to go ahead and proceed to uh, scrape out the, the scales. You can't really see it and the scales are really uh, small so they're not flinging everywhere. And that's why I, I was okay to clean it at home instead of waiting. Uh, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure it fits the plate that I'm going to put it on. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to use salt and go ahead and clean the fish. Basically I'm going to rub the salt to clean the fish and I let it sit there for a while and then and then uh, the salt itself will clean the fish. And you see all the water coming out? Then I'm gonna go ahead and wash it. And it's almost done. Uh, all my recipes are really short, uh, maybe five minutes of prep time. As you can tell, it's not even been five minutes. And I put ginger underneath to get rid of the uh, fishy smell. Uh, smell, But this fish doesn't really have a lot of smell. Um, and the, the fish is tender. And I put some oil in there too. And uh, if you have peanut oil and you're not allergic to it, it's the best because it's the highest cooking temperature. I'm going to go ahead and steam it. Uh, the magic number is 8 minutes to steam almost any fish unless it's super huge, 8 minutes. And now I'm going to be making the sauce for the fish. It's very simple. It's just cooking oil and one part water, one part soy sauce. And then put the scallions in there. Don't forget the scallions. And now all I'm going to do is just put it on top. I'm going to put some of the sauce on top of it first and then after that yeah it's really well done see it's, it's, it's gonna like sort of like sear it a little bit I'll leave some of it 
Yep, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put in my scallions, my green onions. Ooh. Every time I make my own videos for food, I wanna eat the food I make again. It's kinda of strange, isn't it? There goes the scallions. Oh my goodness. I should get this fish again. I just ate it and I wanna eat it again. And now I put in the rest of the soy sauce. And, and that's pretty much it. And we'll go ahead and start eating it and I'll show you how tender and uh, silky the, the meat and everything is. But this fish is super simple, less than, prep time's about less than five minutes, cooking time's about eight minutes. So in about less than 20 minutes, you know, you have a dish ready to cook. And then in, in any fish, in, in, this re in a restaurant, this is probably gonna cost you uh, this size fish, that succulent, is probably gonna cost you anywhere from twenty to thirty dollars. I mean, go go and ask them. So show them the videos. How I want to eat this fish. How much does it cost? It is a, uh, it is not a cheap fish. And then right there, it's perfectly cooked. It's, you see that it's a little bit red, but actually it's basically cooked already. Uh, because as we're as the fish is coming out, it's still being cooked. Uh, that's that's oh, those, those are my favorite parts, the fins, because that's actually the tenderest. Or the most tender Ooh. and the soy sauce I'll show you see that look at that oh man yep to us that's cooked already if you are you are, you are squeamish and you think that's not cooked you can put it in a um, steamer for another minute or so it'll be cooked but this is basically done it is so good oh and yeah and the soy sauce because it's one part water and one part soy sauce, it's actually a little bit sweet. It tastes, it, it, I mean, you just eat 10,000 bowls of rice when that happens. Ugh. Yeah, every single piece, it is so tender. I really enjoy making videos like this for my kids so they know how to steam a fish when they're away. See, no bones. The, only bone is there is actually the main bone and then the fins but uh, yeah it's every single piece every chunk of meat yeah wow and this is uh, the best most tender part is the cheeks of the fish so there's only two cheeks there's only two pieces but that's actually the most tender part is so good I cannot wait to make this fish again Well, enjoy watching me devouring the rest of the fish. Uh, if you're this far down, please hit that like and subscribe button and share the video. It would really help the channel grow so I can show more very fast and easy uh, recipes for busy people like you and I to cook. Uh, the harder recipes, I actually have my wife do them or we go out to eat, but there's a lot of simple recipes out there, especially with the inflation that's happening to America and the world. Uh, it pays for you to eat at home and actually healthier and also it's uh, actually uh, you get more for your dollar Right, I mean hamburgers out there are like five dollars from fast food And I mean just the hamburger like if you go to Carl's Jr. and whatnot This whole fish the cost is seven dollars. I guarantee you it's way healthier than that hamburger And it feeds the whole family the hamburger only feeds one while this this fish fed our whole family. I mean, we have other dish, like veggie too, but this is this was the main dish, and it was just so oh no. Anyway, thank you very much for checking us out, and I'll leave you to enjoy the rest of this beautiful view of my my lovely fish.